We're celebrating our 10-year anniversary of Design Miami. It's been an incredible journey, 10 years in which the fair has grown every year. The first year we had 15 galleries, this year we have 35 galleries, plus four curios, which are exciting projects on the side. Design Curio is a project that we launched thinking about the next 10 years. We've created very small micro booths scattered throughout the fair, and we invited all different kinds of people that work in design to propose ideas that they wanted to explore that were not necessarily commercial and were not necessarily part of the collectible design market that somehow fit into a gallery program or the auction world. So it's meant to be looking at design with like a capital D rather than collectible design. Well, the idea behind the Design Curio program was to really inject the gallery program with these little cabinets of curiosities. So for this first edition of Design Curio, we have four exhibitors participating with us in our 10th anniversary. One, which I'm standing in here now, which is Rolu, presented by Patrick Parrish Gallery. As you can see, the entire booth has been upholstered in a gridded wallpaper all the way down to the floor, which I think this is what we're really looking for in the program, is to create total environments. My name is Colin Ford, and I'm a marine biologist and the co-founder of Coral Morphologic. We are a hybrid art and science endeavor, so we work across a variety of different mediums, such as the Oculus Rift, which is a new technology that we are showcasing for the first time here at Design Miami. We have created specifically for Design Miami a 360 degree film that we call Coral Therapy. So when somebody puts on the Oculus Rift headset, they're basically transported into a virtual planetarium dome in which basically any way that they turn their head up, down, all around, they're essentially enveloped inside of this cosmic planetarium of vibrant fluorescent sea anemones that are native to Miami. My name is Yu Wang. I'm the owner of Gallery All in Los Angeles and Beijing. So this is a sculptural wardrobe designed by Nan Han Li. And the idea of this work is to take on the shape of the building because the building was designed as a continuous loop for TV production. And she taken on the idea is a daily life uh, loop. So you, when your life starting from this side and you can put your makeup on, you can put your clothes on, you put shoes, and here you can open the closet, put on your coat, and at night, you can, when you come back, you reverse the direction of the loop, so it becomes a complete loop of your daily life. And finally, we have Joe Sheftel Gallery and Koenig and Clinton Art Galleries from New York that have presented 35 years of Italian avant-garde design, presenting works of the Memphis period and Ettore Sotsas. I think the Design Curio program really creates an unexpected experience as you travel throughout the fair. I mean, we really have a strong core group of visitors who, who follow the fair in Basel and in Miami, and this is a way to, to really show them something new and something exciting and, and surprise them. From the floor to the ceiling to the wall, they're a very immersive experience, and I think it's very clear that that's the most effective way to use this space and we look forward to getting some really interesting projects now that people have seen these first ones I think they'll really understand how best to use these small spaces and how to communicate with people in a really strong great way.